Thanks for checking out Scotty's Hobbies. Today we're looking at this 2012 Nissan Rogue with a 2.5 liter engine. Here's the underhood label. Make sure we're with the same thing. This should be the same, if not very similar, to the 2007 to 2015 models with the same engine. Starting off right here on top is the PCV valve right on the back side of the valve cover. Really easy to get to. And right above it, you're going to have the emissions vapor purge solenoid. If you need any of these parts shown in the description, in the video, I mean, check for a link in the description to buy them if needed. On the exhaust, exhaust manifold, you're going to have your bank one sensor one right here out of the exhaust manifold before the catalytic converter. And just below that, you're going to have the catalytic converter and the bank one sensor two oxygen sensor down there. Your pre-cat oxygen sensor is actually an air fuel ratio sensor on this vehicle, I believe. Same thing, links in the description to buy the parts if needed. Looking under the vehicle, on the passenger side rear, you're gonna find your vapor canister and the vent solenoid. Right there under that plastic cover is gonna be the canister. At the end of it with the hose is gonna be the EVAP emissions vapor vent solenoid with the electrical connection. This hose right here leads to the valve itself. And then the hose goes into the ambient. So it releases pressure from the EVAP system. Hopefully this helps you in a DIY project or a repair you're doing yourself. Thanks for watching Scotty's Hobbies. Like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you on the next, hopefully helpful video.